Jesus. What a jerk. Get that key. Dude, pick up that key. Yeah, it's about to get buried in blood. Uh, what? I started recording in Audacity. I don't know if we clapped. Oh, you know what? Uh, wait, did we did we start recording in Audacity and like clap and all that? I guess we must have. I started we recording did. in Audacity. I don't know if we clapped. We clapped. We went to time.is. We did the whole thing. We're good. I'm back here. Nice. Yeah, I honestly, big mood. Did you say I'm back here? Yeah. Did we start here. here? No. You know, it's just Silent Hill, baby. Oh, look at Xbox Series Wake X. Up in places. <laughs> it's like a cube. <laughs> yeah, let's see if we see it on the counter. It's on the counter. On the dresser, I guess, is what it is. I've seen the symbol on this key before. Oh, uh, okay. Oh, I'm sure that is the thing that looked like the, the Series X, but... Yeah, that. There it is. <laughs> there it is. Wow, where'd you the get exact one? Series X. <laughs> <laughs> wow, mad jelly, honestly. Even with the microprocessor shortage, this ghost girl got an wow. Xbox Series X. Can't believe it. Hey, I bet that that's, there's more stuff the to do in that room. Let's go back that's there. That's the magic of Silent Hill. So there was, there was, I don't know if you noticed, but there was like a frame of like looking at a keyhole in this room that I assume is that, that key goes to. Uh, I thought it was that it showed me. I thought it was like, yeah, it's a right place there. in the oh, that's that, a no, record that's player. Not. You're just, you're just thinking, you just thinking about audio file shit again. Wow, it seems like they're waiting for something. It's like, yeah, they don't move, dude. They're dolls. Wow, I was in such a confined space. It took all the way until now for me to get really upset about how slow the camera is. I, I just feel like there's got to be something else in there. Nah, we got the key. No, you're right. I just look back at the guide. You're right. Duh. After Alex wakes up in Scarlet's room again, he will automatically take the founder's key from the broken doll. Boy, that was not fun at all. Is that I don't what know. it what says? What do you think? Would you think that was fun at all? No. <laughs> I mean, like. It was a boss that felt good to do well against, but the time, but any time it would hit me, it often felt, it felt like these were, Too these punishing. were the rough edges of its combat system showing its, showing themselves where like, it would feel like it would hit me with like an invisible attack box where like its arms didn't actually touch me or like, mm -hmm. are you there? Yeah, I said, mm-hmm. Okay, I think you're you were getting ducked. I couldn't quite hear you. Let's go to the town hall. Trotting through fog. Remember that? Yeah. Remember? We all love yes, that. 
This is, I would call this the national, uh, I guess, local pastime of Silent Hill. <laughs> Fog jogging. I've got to. I've got to say, I've been playing. How did, be the wow! Show. How did it take this many years for us to get to fog jogging? <laughs> We've done fog jogging. <laughs> no, we haven't. It's brand new. <coughs> you, you couldn't find any evidence of this ever. Ah! No! That door sucks. Close that door. Yeah, don't go in that door. That's a bad door. Um. We talked about this a little bit in, in um, Metal Gear Solid, but I've been playing a lot of MLB The Show. Yeah. And uh, the more I play it, the more I'm just like, it's such a shame that baseball isn't more popular. What a good game. Hmm. As a game, it is easily the most interesting game of all the sports. I don't, I don't know. Because, like, okay, football, throw the ball, catch the ball, run to the line. Basketball. <laughs> that's, pass yeah, the that's ball, all that's going on in football. Pass the ball, shoot the, the ball. Throw the ball, catch the ball. Yeah. I think, no, I think, see they what happens. Hold on. Is, that is all that's going on in football. No. See, see hang on. There's all of these sports. Strategy. No, 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 no. Stop, 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 stop. Stop, stop, stop. Give me a chance. Give me a chance here. Okay. The thing about all these sports is that they're really simple games, uh, but the you know it's the strategy comes from the fact that there are so many people that just only think about this game all day every day for for their whole lives. Mm -hmm. And so, like when you listen to somebody who knows all about the sport, you're like, oh, that sport is really interesting. Like I peg baseball as being easily the most boring uh, and uninteresting of all the sports. Right. But I will admit that when I hear you talk about baseball, I'm like, okay, baseball is kind of interesting. Okay, you're just not a football person. Here's my my counterpoint, though. I know the rules of football, and I know the rules of baseball. Baseball is not a simple sport. Like, conceptually, it is more complicated than all of the other sports. Like, uh, like the surface level description of baseball is way more complicated than the surface level description of football. I, I think, I mean... It's an I think asymmetrical I think American football one versus can be pretty team. hard for people to wrap their heads around. Say again? I, I think American football can be pretty hard for people to wrap their heads around. Yeah? Yeah, the whole down system, four downs, and then you have to, then the ball turns over, and... Three outs, four downs, ball turns over. Baseball has the exact same thing. Well, I guess... It's, I guess. It is like one you versus can't, one. It's you like can't have... tennis and golf that then turns into tag... But there, there's no, like, surprise ending to a round. Like, oh, the team stole the ball. Now they get to bat. Like, the out, you know, the fielding team stole batting. No, that that does happen. I mean... In what way? It doesn't happen in the exact same way as, like, an interception happens. But right. you can get, like, uh, because of the get weird rules of baseball, you can, like, a person can catch a ball and it just becomes an unassisted double play and then the round mm -hmm. ends, the, 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 the inning ends. Okay. Um, like, like there, there's one out already, um, and then there's oh, a did, there's oh. a a line drive to the first baseman who catches the ball and steps on the base, and because the first base runner didn't have time to tag up, that means that there's basically two outs that happen simultaneous simultaneously, and then all of a sudden the inning's over. Um. And then there's there's a, there's all this weird like you're right that the, there's a lot of uh, uh, tertiary yeah. depth to football in the same way that there's tertiary depth to baseball, um, but the 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 there's also conceptual depth to baseball where I think you know I'm not gonna I wouldn't hold it against the other sports that that they are conceptually fairly simple but. Uh, it is uh, it is what I like about baseball that even on the surface, it's bizarre. Let me let me read this, please. With the truth of the old believers fractured, it is essential that one person maintain an F 
uh, effectuate the modern sectarian rights we have toiled. Oh, fuck. Wait, can you get attacked while reading that? Yes, I thought I got them all. I Did had you just no spit idea. At me? That you get attacked. Well, I didn't know that until I tried to read that thing a second ago and I could still hear them taking footsteps. I was like, oh, oh okay. okay. Yeah, I, um, you know, I know it's just a matter of, oh, yeah, let's read the thing now. Okay. Um, uh, we <coughs> toiled so faithfully to create and protect. After taking up the mantle of this post, the performer of rites shall make a pilgrimage to the edge of the forsaken region to purify himself from the sins of the past. There he will beseech the forefathers for forgiveness and understanding. Beseech them! In God's name, so it shall be. So it shall be! <coughs> In the pursuit of creating a more perfect way, rules must be followed and rules must be enforced. Any member who ignores this command shall be dealt with swiftly and in view of all. This shall ensure continued prosperity. Continued it is prosperity. therefore imperative that the effective master of arms not wave in the responsibility of enacting this power until his last day of this life. In God's name, so it shall be. So it shall be! the last one yeah i'm glad we got to read those in a really normal way oh, oh two no more. fuck in defense of the tenets it is necessary that one person preside over the punishments of any member who have fallen from the path these Falling rulings from the must path. be based on complete understanding of the laws set forth and must be executed without prejudice the executor of law must not waive in the responsibility of enacting this power. He must declare his oath in public forum to uphold the ideals of the book. In God's name, so it shall be. So it shall be. To continue on the path we have laid before us, it is vital that the people remember the road traveled. We must continually provide update uh, update and in we must continually provide update and nurture accurate records of the past that cannot be challenged by outsiders mm, once outsiders. the lore has been handed over the keeper shall confine himself to an uncorrupted sanctuary there he will learn the history of the founders in god's name so it shall be so it shall be i haven't really been listening to any of this it's all fluff. It's a bit cult shit. The keeper shall confine himself to an uncorrupted sanctuary. History of the founders. Ours fan. We are. We're a fam founding family. We're a founding um, family. This is our Glenn, right? We're Alex Shepard. Yeah. I couldn't remember our name. Thanks for reminding me. Um, I was, what was I going to say about base? Oh, I was just going to say that I know that it's all like a, you know, it's all just a matter of perspective, but I never bought the ar the argument that, uh, Ooh, that, 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 baseball symbol. Was, that baseball was slow. I don't, mm. I don't. Okay. Um, I feel like one of the strengths of baseball is that there's always something happening. You know, there's a pitch. There's like three pitches a minute. Um, and so if if anything, it's a more consistent pace than football, which has like a lot of people moving mm -hmm. for like 15 seconds at a time. But then there's like a four minute reset period. What? That's our daddy. Oh. Cool. Okay, so our dad was doing like ceremonial cult shit. 
when nice. we interrupted him. He wasn't just like, I don't know, drinking. He was like, hey, I do, I'm summoning the devil in here. So that's my take. So, so, a lot of people say baseball is slow. I think football is Ooh, the one it's that's a slow. Weapon. So it's it's it evens out. It's neutral. Argument deleted. That's uh, that's this. how that works. Wow. Sorry, folks. Keith just de deleted your argument. You mm -hmm. you bunch of goobers. Argument deleted. Argument deleted. It's like bowling. Football is like bowling to me. Oh, so now what do we like? We go stick this in the door at home and we can open it. Ooh, that's a good idea. Football is like bowling to you? Yeah, you know, you you roll the ball and then all the stuff happens and then no, the machine like has to baseball. put all the parts back in place. No. I mean, baseball it, is it, the one where someone throws a ball down a lane. No, it's not about the throwing. It's about the moment of action and then the period of setup. That's that's what I mean about the bowling where, you know, <clears throat> pins get knocked down and then they have to go, they have to be put back in the right order before you can start again. Uh, except it takes, it takes like three minutes. You can only, you can only push bookshelves from the left side. I should have realized that. I need this. I collect these. Whoa, Isaac Shepard. Um, oh, right, that, okay, this was the thing, was the whole time we were like, where is that, where's the shepherd? And, and here he is. So why isn't he on the wall? So why isn't he on the wall? <clears throat> um, how do I get out of here? I asked and answered. Anyway, back to my original point, which okay. is that. Um, it's a shame that baseball is not more popular because it's it is it is the most interesting game of all the sports. I think. I this mean, is, I think it's hard to deny. You grew, I don't feel like you it's grew even up in Massachusetts. What's that? You you grew up in Massachusetts. You need baseball to be more popular. I don't know anyone that likes baseball. Like my my cousin Kenny loves baseball, and my childhood best friend Ben McCarthy likes baseball. And those are the only two baseball fans I really know. Like, baseball is a dying sport. All the people that like it are dead or dying. Baseball is bringing it back. I hope so. Oh, that one's my house. Got it. Um, but it's also... The other, the other interesting thing about baseball is that it's, like, impossible. I know that all sports are like this. All professional sports are like this. But it's, like, impossible. The thing that is being asked of baseball players is insane. I've actually, um... I had just been... I know this is dumb to say. I had just not been bringing it up because I had been planning on... Uh, talking about it on Snooze Button for whatever reason. But since you're talking about sports, I have been watching that uh, Chicago Bulls documentary on Netflix, The Last Dance. I'm is that the Michael that. Jordan produced one? I think so. I is he in it a lot? Is. And does he come across like an asshole? Uh, yes. <laughs> then maybe. To I both? don't know. <laughs> uh, I know people were watching there's... it a few months ago. It came out last year, yeah. Yeah. Uh, it, it simultaneously tells the story, like the... the it's got like an A and B story, and it's um, the story of... Uh, Michael Jordan's last season with the Bulls and Scottie Pippen and Dennis Rodman and uh, 
and the B story is like the whole um, story of Michael Jordan and the Bulls leading up to that. Michael Jordan's time at school, and then a little bit about like Scottie Pippen and Dennis Rodman's times at school. And I got killed by a dog. By split personalities. I just remembered they're called. Oh wait, no, I got killed by a dog. Um, I think maybe the split personalities got the last hit in, but it was really the dog that pinned you to the ground that caused you to die. Um. Um. Real? Did I? Did it take my knife? No, it's up there. It's at the top. No, my my ceremonial knife. Oh, did it maybe? Wow, it it set me back pretty far. Oh, that sucks. Well, at least there was really nothing to do down here except avoid those slow nurses. Yeah. <clears throat> Hello. Um. Uh, yeah, the, th the thing that I always think about when I watch baseball or when I've been playing this this baseball game is like... <coughs> like, uh... Batters are being asked to it's hit... It's really funny that the nurses are here. <laughs> I know, just watching you take the thing. Um, the batters are being asked to hit this little ball with their with their bat to one of the, like, that is moving 95 miles an hour to one of the very few places in a stadium that is not within easy running distance of, like, a crowd of your enemies. Um, and it, it is such a hard thing to do that doing it about 25% of the time makes you one of the best in the world at it. Um, mm. uh, meanwhile, the fe the people feeling the ball are expected to be basically perfect at it. Like, mm -hmm. if you drop a ball, that is such a bad thing that it doesn't even count as a hit anymore. It counts as an error against you. Um, uh, Wait, what? Yeah, if you, like, drop a ball, that doesn't count as a hit. It counts as a miss, because, like, by all accounts, you should have been out, but this idiot didn't do his job right, and so he gets an error. Um, and then, uh, and then, like, pitch if they, hmm? like, it, what, like, it touches their glove, but they don't catch it? It depends on the, their scores not... that decide when something is an error, but yeah, basically, if someone, like, drops a ball, or if it rolls through your head, there's a guy that basically decides, especially for the infield, like, if you were able to reach something, but weren't able to get, actually get the out, then then it's your fault. It doesn't count as a hit because that guy should have been out and you get an error scored against you. That's how baseball works. Um, and and then the pitchers are, <laughs> the pitchers are supposed to take that little ball and throw it in like a one foot, one square foot box. Mm -hmm like a hundred times a game, like 80 times a game, um, uh, and make it so that the person who bats baseballs professionally can't do it. And then the umpires are supposed to stand there and watch and have a little box in their minds and then decide if these little balls are in the box or out of the box. <laughs> like, it's just crazy. Like everything that happens in baseball is wild. Um, Yeah, it All just right. it just seems That's like fair. such a fucking hard game to play. Versus um, like you know, there's a ton of talent in football, and undeniably, um, and I think the last couple few decades have been very um, quarterback focused in recognizing that talent. Um, but there is a sense of like. Like, uh, you know, uh, as a, as a football layman, a uh, lot of the time it seems like if you're, if you're big and strong, you can just be on a football team and <laughs> like, like block while a pitch, while a, while a play is happening. I don't really know what makes one of those guys better than another one of those guys. 
Uh, it's it's very nice. It's not apparent from just watching. Um, but but everyone that is on a baseball team is doing something kind of impossible. Um, I will agree. You know, it's, especially because I'm um in the middle of this Bulls documentary, so I'm thinking a lot about basketball and another. and like and yeah, and another another sport where like everybody just has to play at this unbelievable level. Yeah. Um, and and like I agree. Like on a football field, most of the players on that field are not being held to a standard that is anything like the standard that like baseball and yeah. football, uh, and then they play once a week instead of players six playing times a week. Soccer players, I guess. What's that? And then, and then they, they play, play once, once a week, week instead of six times a week. <laughs> it's funny. Yeah. <laughs> like all, yeah. That's the other thing is like all of that impossible shit. You have to do that every day of the week. Um. Um. So I, I guess my recommendation house? is if you've never understood baseball, you should pick up. You should you should get on free on Games Pass or pick up for PlayStation, um, the oh. show the show twenty one, and do some of the um, road to the show mode because I think that's okay. a really good sort of primer on like what is fun and good about mm. baseball. It does a really it it does this really cool thing where it basically like it basically auto fast forwards through the times when your guy isn't doing something so like when you're batting it just like what the fuck why does this game keep switching my weapon oh there's a quick switch Sorry. weapon button maybe you keep pressing it yeah i guess um i also got like to the name... whole game is so cumbersome that like it, oh my god it look at Wow, okay, jeez. You got I think you yeah, you just gotta go inside. I think stairs confuse all these enemies, so let's see what happens. Why don't you just go inside? No, he just came I, right it won't let he me just the go into the door. I feel like you've really missed your shot to get into the door. I dude, I told you the door is locked. Oh it's locked? Oh no, yeah. I did I didn't hear you say that. I think maybe you don't. Uh, Do you think the game is it, it wants you to kill these guys? It, I mean, it it sure seems to. Sure I mean, if they want me to do something with these guys. Uh, Dresher says I kind of like baseball. I just never pay attention to it unless I'm in the stadium. Uh, yeah, I that's and that's pretty much the same with with me. I think one of baseball's biggest problems is that it sabotages itself by having so many games. Like I think I legit think baseball would be more popular if there was like two games a week instead of six. Yeah, six is a lot. Six is a lot. It's stupid. That's that. That's pretty stupid. There's like 350 games a season. Like it's insane. Yeah. Any. Of the, it's such a stupid thing to say, but it's like you're devaluing your product. How many games per season? MLB. Okay. <laughs> it's so funny. The Major League Baseball season schedule generally consists of... Do you want to guess? 268 games. 162 games per 30 oh. teams. Uh, played over six months for a total of 2,430 games plus the postseason. If we can go by digits, I was, I was only... I was like 100 off. But I was like really close number. if my <laughs> it's only off by one. It was just in the hundreds place. Uh I mean like did the game like the game just didn't want to give me any ammo. Like these um these these stupid pendulum head things this was 
I fought these things in the shotgun part of the game. Yeah. Where it was feeding me shotgun ammo. Yeah. Um, do you... I think the crowbar is probably what you want for these guys. I don't know that the ceremonial yeah. dagger is a great choice. I'll say that. If I had to just do a wild guess, I would say that the ceremonial dagger does less damage than the regular dagger. Well, no, it replaces my regular dagger. Oh, did it really? Yeah. Oh, okay, I didn't realize that. So never mind. I think. It's oh, it's. I mean, it's a. It's a ceremonial dagger, but it's like a. We're talking a good ceremony, though. Yeah, I just. I wouldn't. I wouldn't have. I wouldn't have. Um, put it past Silent Hill to give you a new dagger that's worse than your original dagger because it's ceremonial. <laughs> Maybe I'll I'll put it in the door at home and then it'll be gone. And my regular knife will be back and we'll be talking about those the fleeting days when we had the ceremonial dagger. Good well, point. I'm sick of this shit. Sorry. Are you done? Yeah, I'm done. I can't I can't do this anymore. <laughs>